there's a question that I work in an Islamic shop and sometimes customers speak bad about particular categories of people. Is it obligatory for me to correct them? And what do I say? Um, one should know two things. One should know the fiqh of commanding the good and forbidding the wrong. And secondly, the guidance related to being a person of sincere counsel, of nasiha. And if you do that, then you know how to act because you only, it is obligatory to command the good and forbid the wrong when it's an obligatory matter. And number two, number two, you are hopeful that it will be of benefit. You're hopeful that it will be of benefit. And sincere counsel as well is recommended and nasiha is recommended when all things considered it's likely to be of benefit. Otherwise, we make good character our argument. Right? And people who don't know, we help them to know by good conduct with them, by patience, and by gradually steering them towards what benefits them. The Prophet ﷺ never argued with anyone. He presented clearly and convincingly and then let people decide. If you consider some of the leading Sahaba, their own parents, their own siblings, only entered Islam after the opening of Mecca. Abu Bakr, his father, only became Muslim after the Fetah of Mecca. Alhamdulillah. <laughs>